Hello everyone, welcome back. Another thrift store finds video. Went out with Amanda and found a few things including we'll start off with the VHS. A couple of tapes a little more on the uncommon side. We have The Gate and this Ringling Brothers Barnum and Bailey, the Big Cats of the Big Top. The Wizard of Oz on Ice. Something unusual that I've never seen before. Might be an interesting watch. We're never a big fan of these whatever on ice things, especially not being there, but it'll be curious one time watches. I've never seen it. Another one of these Bear in the Big Blue House. Usually pick up a lot of those so I can find them. Wish I could find more like Gullah Gullah because those are much bigger sellers, but um, a vintage copy of the Marx Brothers Go West. Always been a big fan of the Marx Brothers, especially Groucho. Groucho is like one of the funniest people ever. One video game find. Just shocking, I know. At the bins doesn't happen very often, but Spyro the Dragon few DVD finds, uh, some full moon horror. We have Netherworld and Seed People. This three disc collection horror cinema, 15 hours from the amazing Echo Bridge. And uh, yes, I say that sarcastically. Uh, but yeah, it's a nice little horror collection. Movies from a bunch of different decades. We have uh, The Doors, live in Europe, 1968. And then a whole bunch of kids' books and a couple other odds and ends here. Some Care Bears. Some of the Warriors and Rangers Apprentice. I find these pretty frequently. Uh, this is one's one of the comic books. Don't see that quite as often. A one board game that was worth picking up. Uh, don't pick up a lot of them, especially when they are open up because you have to make sure they're complete and sometimes it's just not worth your time if it's like hundreds of pieces but uh, this was good this labyrinth game uh, from Ravensburg so that was really cool and it's actually a German language version which is interesting uh, but that was definitely worth grabbing and a few larger books this is actually a really cool this like faux leather uh, who is this is uh, time life yeah time life books the old west the gunfighters that was an interesting find and then uh, this is uh, one that I actually kind of want to look at first. We have the Golden Age of M Movie Musicals, the MGM years. It's a neat find. And this one is definitely more for me. Amanda actually grabbed this and she said, I think you might be interested in this, and I was. Uh, the Great Films, 50 Golden Years of Motion Pictures. Which is, it's funny because it goes up to like almost 70 years ago, was those 50 years, but a lot, looks like a lot of great pictures and some interesting information. This will be a big, cool, fun, like classic movie book to look through, so I'm really going to uh, enjoy giving that a read. That was it for today, and make sure you check out, I also went to a massive book sale, and that video will be up, and that was a big surprise. I found a lot of really, really good stuff. And uh, later this week, I've got a big box of a really interesting VHS find. So I'm going to want to talk about that and all kinds of stuff coming up. As, uh, today was a, this is actually a really busy, like packed week full of all kinds of things. And then as I'm filming this, we're in the in-between time on this weird day where there's a Nintendo Direct and a Sony, you know, state of play on the same day, and uh, we'll see if I do a video on those. Depends how much there is. If there's, you know, something worth talking about uh, for my particular interest, but we will see how that's going. Uh, it's kind of unusual having both on the same day, so maybe there'll be some really cool things to talk about.